welcome to Unacademy Neat English. I'm your biology educator Ambika Sharma and in today's video I'm going to tell you about the top 100 topics of biology. You know that biology is making 50% of your syllabus and we have to revise the complete NCERT of 11th and 12th if we want to score 330 plus marks in the biology. But bache, here I'm going to give you the list because there are some students who start their NEET journey uh, uh, late and they don't know which topics they need to focus and which topics they should avoid. In biology, no doubt, each and every line written in NCRT is important, but yeah, there are some short, short topics from where definitely the question will come and from each and every chapter, I am going to provide you that short, short topics. So make sure that you complete these 100 topics, right? And if you complete these 100 topics, uh, let me tell you this student, mark my words, you are going to get 310 plus marks, right? Even it can go above 320 and 330, let me tell you this thing, because these topics are covering the entire syllabus and these topics are also you know uh, there are uh, the parts which I didn't cover here in this uh, list now the topics are also covered so make sure that you watch this till the end do like the video and do subscribe to our channel so here we go here you can see the list I'll provide you this in our official telegram channel as well so mechanism of hormone action I started with the class 11 syllabus right in a reverse order so make sure that you note down these topics so mechanism of hormone action for sure this year you will get question from this part and make sure with this topic you focus on the examples as well that which hormone is having the plasma receptors on the plasma membrane which hormones are having receptors within the cell this is what you need to take care then disorders okay not just from this particular chapter of chemical coordination and integration you should not miss even a single disorder from the human physiology you should make a list write down all the disorders and revise it you will get two or three questions from the disorders only uh, you can even check your uh, last year papers as well okay then ionic theory of nerve impulse conduction because now there is no eye topic there is no ear topic so for sure you will get this particular part if you ask about the brain then i will suggest you one thing that please focus on the meninges only the revised meninges only that's it that will be sufficient for you and uh, you can solve pyqs on the basis of brain okay there are very few questions and in this way you will complete the topic of brain as well because i know for some students that topic is also scary right but after that the sliding filament thing a very 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 important topic that you should never ever miss joints from joints part you can pick up the examples because it is also the part of your practical biology syllabus right students then regulation of kidney function right role of all the hormones here you should cover it it is something very important now when it comes to the nephron the diagram you should know which cells are lining the PCT. You should know which part is permeable to water, which part is permeable to electrolyte. So basically, when you talk about the nephron, you have to cover the entire topic, right? You should even know the glomerular filtration part, uh, basically the urine formation part and the countercurrent mechanism. Because if you will understand the nephron structure properly, right, that which part is uh, playing role in absorption, in secretion, then trust me, you will complete all that three topics altogether. So make sure you revise it uh, blood clotting ecg for sure mechanism of breathing oxygen hemoglobin dissociation curve emphysema i marked it separately because you have to cover it with the uh, biotech part as well you know na alpha 1 antitrypsin is used to treat emphysema it is given in your biotechnology part so complete this topic okay complete this topic then growth regulators in plant growth regulators the most important thing is you should know the function of the hormones okay so here specifically you need to pay attention on the functions growth rates arithmetic geometric you know it number of ATP molecules generated in that energy conversion so this is from the respiration chapter so students you know that now from plant physiology two chapters are deleted right so please make sure students please make sure that you don't miss plant physiology this time more number of questions will be there from these three chapters so so that ATP molecules, how many you are getting from glycolysis, from uh, you know Krebs cycle uh, in aerobic breakdown, in anaerobic breakdown. So in that context, you should remember the ATP molecule part. Okay, then RQ value, respiratory question, tricarboxylic acid cycle, that is your citric.
Cetric cycle. And in Cetric cycle, what you need to focus, how many steps are of substrate level phosphorylation and how many steps you know, your NADH and your FADH will form. So such reactions you need to keep in your mind. Then C3, C4 plants, obviously that comparison is important. The cycles are also important, right? So cyclic photophosphorylation, non-cyclic, can be osmotic hypotheses as well okay so as i said only three chapters are there so more number of questions will come from this particular portion then cell cycle itself is very important mitosis meiosis for sure questions will be there these are the topics that you should never miss never miss and if you are about to start your revision please make sure that you start from these particular question then which enzymes right from biomolecules one should not miss it the bond formation peptide and glycosidic bond formation then amino acid like uh, which amino acid is neutral which one is acidic basic okay the aromatic one the zwitter ion so amino acid part is important then the structures which are given in your biomolecules okay the structures that are given in your ncrt please do not miss that structures they are very easy one question will be there from your structure part when you talk about the cell chapter cytoskeletons microtubules microfilaments intermediate filaments you should know them if you will cover cytoskeleton automatically that cilia flagella part will be completed so do not miss this topic for this particular year for NEET 2024 for sure you will get a question from this part then function of cell organelle is uh, unavoidable so now when it is the anatomy comparison of the sections okay it's monocot root dicot root your monocot stem dicot stem or leaves you should compare that section just pick up that part that will be more than sufficient for all of you and yeah xylem and phloem they are elements they are made up of what and their function that's it now from morphology i know it's very lengthy so many examples are there but do not miss the flower part the presentation part the inflorescence part these three are the most important topics then basis of classification from animal kingdom okay and then of course we know that there is no substitute for the examples so for that i'll tell you just keep on revising rather than giving one round of solid revision please give so many rounds of rough revision that will solve your problem in the examples binomial nomenclature is there bache and then five kingdom that table right that on what basis we are dividing them in different different kingdoms then examples from your protista this is cdes P, that is your protista, chryso, dino, euglenoids, slime mold, protozoa, fungi, their classes and their examples. Their classes and their examples. Life cycle of plants. It is not specifically written in your new syllabus, but if you will cover the life cycles, it will complete majority of part from your algae, bryo, teredo, gymno. You will not get confused. Algae, that table is for sure, you have to, you have to complete this table. Then pteridophytes. This time, please pay attention on the pteridophytes. Then now, class 12 syllabus, pollination, epomixis polyembryony, gametophytes development, male and female both. Endosperm individually, you should know about it, right? So do not miss epomixis part. Do not miss your uh, this uh, endosperm comparison part for this particular year. Then which is pregnancy right that complete development part from the implantation and all this is what you should cover placentation right the placenta formation plus the hormones release the gametogenesis menstrual cycle they are all related topics right it will complete all your hormonal control then assisted reproductive technology stis mtp from these three right you will get minimum four questions i'm telling you this thick minimum four questions you will get from these topics post mendelian inheritance co-dominance incomplete dominance right your multiple allelism and all then sex determination and sex linked inheritance very 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 important your pleiotropy mendelian disorders very important now dna rna part individually the comparison the structure nitrogenous basis this is what you people need to know then but hgp genetic code please do not leave it if you are planning to leave molecular basis of inheritance at least read these two topics the most important one the role of enzymes 
in all the processes of DNA replication, transcription, translation. What that enzymes are doing? What is the role of helicase? What is the role of ligase? This is something that you should definitely know. Then, but sense anti sense strand. I'm picking up the definitions as well, right? It is not just the detailed topics. I'm picking up the definitions as well. As well, like in transcription, we talk about the template strand, also known as your uh, non-coding strand. So you should know about it. Then packaging of chromosome, of course, important. Histone part will be covered operon fingerprinting now in the next slide i have written that with fingerprinting always read the satellite dna part then your hardy wingward principle adaptive radiation one example will for sure come from this part for this particular year evolution of human human because even last year question was missing from this part so you should not miss this topic for this year genetic drift homologous analogous natural selection so students find it difficult to read the evolution in on this channel itself you will get the one shot and do not miss these topics from the evolution part then much HIV, the complete, you know, the complete uh, that life cycle of this, you should know about it. Immunity, what is active, what is passive, what is specific, what is non specific, everything you have to cover. Microbes, right? Two questions will come from microbes part, right? That which one is giving you the uh, from where you are getting the statins, from where you are getting the cyclosporin A, for sure question will come. Sewage treatment, one question this year definitely be come from it separately. Then RDNA, overall this process is important. I have even discuss the parts here so gel electrophoresis satellite dna downstream processing do not miss this restriction enzymes do not miss this and vectors features also so overall our dna is covering it but separately do read it as well revise it as well then but human insulin gene therapy then come to the next part eco ecology population interactions attributes productivity pyramids losses so these are this is the list i have provided you i separately mentioned mutations hotspots translation drug abuse malaria and chikungunya chikungunya is a new topic then one question will be there from the chikungunya so this is the list you will get this list in our telegram group which in our official telegram group in the description box you will get the link for it and moreover i'm pretty sure that you people know about our dream crash course batch it is something very amazing students are very happy with the way we are conducting the revision so all i can tell you student is that be the part of this crash course even if you are planning to join it after two days or three days please don't do this because till then we will finish uh, like two chapters in biology okay then again there will be the backlog so if you want to join it join now this is the right time you still have time right you are going to get the tests here the assignments here the mcqs from different different books not just my mcqs mcqs from different different books you are going to get right there is no need to go for other resources solve the questions there ask the doubts from your teachers and there will be separate doubt sessions as well okay so be the part of this amazing crash course the team is amazing so in the description box itself you will get the link for it press that link add your details and be the part do not delay and trust me believe in yourself you can crack it be confident be consistent and whatever topics you have covered just pin that that just write down that comment in the comment section and if you want a separate video on, on any of the topic do let me know so all the best take care thank you so much everyone